looking at the explosiveness on the floor tonight, Steve, this game should be filled with highlight real play. I love it, Kevin. Fans love watching these matchups, and we do too. Now let's check out our starters for the Los Angeles Lakers. Up at forward, the star pairing of LeBron and Davis. Then there's Kobe, LeBron and there's D'Angelo Russell, and it's Reeves in at the two. The raw power of James excels at taking on physical defense and finishing. Russell against Spain, and there's the pass to Jackson. And he drops it in from the low post. During the pre-draft process, some scouts felt Jackson was behind the curve as a passer. He's proven those concerns were overstated. And that was the mobile one drive. Well worth a second look. It's all about the ability to get two feet in the paint, whether it's creating for a teammate or for yourself. And James throws it down. Beautiful location on the pass, as usual. Led his man perfectly. Just over a minute played here in the start of the game. Jones, the pass to Adams. And a wide open look for Bain. Barry's the long range jumper. Impressive accuracy of Desmond Bain. He has put in the work to be a reliable three point option. Outside, Kobe. Down low. And James throws it down. Oh, Kevin, not a petty, not a Manny, but a facial. Oh, a bounce to the ounce, Greg? Yeah, showing off the bunny. Now here's Jones. They really needed more from him in that loss to the Lakers. And Adams kicks to Bain. Off target from outside. For Los Angeles, they've gotten their first three shots to go in for him to start off this game. And the basket is good. Got it to go through on the contact, so a free throw coming up. A great opportunity for a three-point play. All right, we'll take a look now at how the points have been generated so far. The scoring breakdown for the Lakers. For me, they made a point to attack inside early in the game, and it's paid off for them. A lot of solid looks in the paint. And it seems they've also put an emphasis on moving the ball, working to rotate around the defense and find those quality looks. Jones for three, trains the three-pointer. Doesn't get exactly the screen he wants, but turns out he doesn't need it. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Alden. David. Well, Kevin, Coach Taylor Jenkins gave me a few minutes to catch up. This is their second meeting with this team. The first one didn't go as well as they liked, so this time around, they're going to try to close the lane off, push drivers and slashers as far away from the basket as possible. We'll see how that goes, Kevin. Thank you, David. Well, we know we're in the later stages of his career, but Steve, it's just simply incredible, mind-boggling, really, how athletic LeBron James remains. Kevin, to put it frankly, we've never seen anything like this. He's still getting up with ease really for some out. vicious throwdowns. A testament to how hard he works. I mean, one of the greatest players of all time. LeBron just continuing to add to his legacy. So timeout call here. First for Memphis. They couldn't put the pieces together, losing the last matchup with the Lakers. And defensively in that one, they needed to come up with big stops to quiet that crowd. And that's obviously easier said than done. Yes, the other team is feeding off that enthusiasm. You have to try and match that energy. Adam's shot is off. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D is just enough to keep him out of rhythm. And that one, good. They are on fire, just in a great groove here early on. Outside, Bain. Adams outside. Outside, Jones. Six on the shot clock. And another miss by Memphis. Lakers leading by five. But Greg, I'm sure their coach is very pleased with their offensive flow right now. I mean, it's harder than it looks to get it going like this. Now they just have to maintain it. Go, go, go. 
Jones the pass to Bain. And that comes off the assist by Jones. Baines got a pair of threes now in the first quarter for the Grizzlies. James outside. Pass to Kobe. Back to James. Good for the fifth time in five shots. He remains perfect. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Adams against Kobe. Here's Jackson. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Jared has size and the ability to finish with either hand. He can take defenders head on. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. They oh, yes. Oh, yes. Respect LeBron showing the artistry that other players could only dream of. And now, let's take one more look at that great mobile one drive. Well, he's been a huge factor in this game, and drives like that show how valuable he is on the floor. And Adams with the slam. One of the cases where height fails to tell you the whole story. And here's Russell. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. MP. Count the bucket, and he's got a free throw coming up as well. And the game plan is clear. Work the ball inside. And at this point in the season, Gray, many coaches still are maneuvering their lineups, trying to find the right formula. Especially the younger team. There's no real established pecking order, and guys can be wildly inconsistent from night to night. He's one of those guys who is extra difficult to block out. When LeBron really wants a rebound, it's hard to beat him to the ball. I'm out called the Grizzlies. And the lack of rim protection is top of the list. And it boils down to the question. Toughness. One team showing it, the other allowing itself to be bullied. The Grizzlies trail by eight. Outside, Bain. Outside, Jones. Pass to Bain. Five on the clock. Misses the three. I'm shocked that didn't turn into three points. I mean, he makes you pay on those nearly every time. And you can see their strategy coming in. They want to control the paint. This is my type of approach. Get some high percentage looks. Then later, you can play inside out. Here's Bain after the basket by the Lakers. And it's blocked. James looking it over. Pass to Kobe. Davis in the corner. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Up top, Kobe. The kick out to LeBron. It's hauled in by Adams. You expect him to make that, especially from that distance. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. Kobe, the pass to Reeves, and he dunks it down. Building up a big early lead, they have taken charge of this game. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. And it's the Grizzlies with the ball after the basket by the Lakers. Jones, the pass to Jackson. A fader. His shot is good, making a perfect two for two from the floor. Not just a floor spacer with the jump shot. Jaren solid also from the mid-range. Here's James trying to get open as Davis. And James gets it to go. LeBron's got 17. And you can't help but pick their defense apart. They're completely in disarray. On the wing, Jones. Outside Jackson. On the wing, Bain. That's good. And it's Jackson with the assist that time. Baines got it back down to a single-digit deficit for Memphis. Adams against Kobe. Loads it up for MP. 
Oh, and they get in the way of the alley -oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Inside. And Adams with the slam. He's a power player. That's a grown man move by Steven Adams. Kobe with it. Hearted now by Jackson. Outside, Davis. Back to Kobe. Shoots it up. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. And that's 10 straight points in the paint. The defense. Nowhere to be Los Angeles getting their fourth attempt at the free throw line right here. And Kobe, no good on that. The Grizzlies trail by nine. In the corner, it's Bain. Free throw line, jump shot. And Davis sends it back. The crazy reach of AD coming into play. He uses it so well to reject shots. And it's Davis finishing it off. Boy, that was quick. Already out to a double-digit lead. This has been a beatdown right here. Possibly over before it began. Now here's White. He had a 15-point outing in their last game against the Lakers in Los Angeles. It's White on the wing. The pass to Tillman. Pocket six. And again, it's the Grizzlies from deep. Beautiful find by Derek White. When you start your career with Coach Popovich, you either make the next pass or you don't get minutes. Rebound by Kobe. Kobe's got his fourth rebound in this one. And here they come. Here's Davis. Can't hit the turnaround jumper. The Grizzlies trail by eight. Jones kicks to White, pulls up on the wing. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. Kobe's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Here's Davis. Yes, it's James picking up the assist. Eight points for Davis. The added strength helping Davis on these physical finishes. Great work from the big man. It's Jones on the wing. And it's off from three-point range. Lakers leading by 10. Right side, Kobe. Back to James. It's MP, top of the key. He feeds it to Davis. Count that one. Davis has got 10 points. You see the weight that 80's added to his frame over the years. Now invites contact. Outside, White. Passes it to Bing. Here's Tillman. Guarded by Kobe. He dents the rim with a two-handed slam. Wow. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, GA, right when your teammate makes that kind of play. The problem is your opponent is making big plays as well. I'll be curious to see the response. Here's Kobe following the score by Memphis. Russell finds MP. Floats it up for James. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by MP. You want unselfishness, but you also need to keep it under control. Glad we got the chance to see that remarkable rejection. And, and this is how you protect and grow a lead by making a huge effort on that end of the floor. Now here's Jones. Payne for three. Impeccable timing on the rejection. You better watch out when LeBron is around. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. First person and at the offensive end, he's done about as much as they could hope for today. This is his second trip to the free throw line. At the line for one. And in their last contest, guys, he was unconscious from the foul line. Forty seconds left in the first quarter. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. White with it. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Back to Bain. Connects from three-point range. Beautiful mechanics from Desmond Bain. Doesn't need much time to get his shot off. Now here's Kobe. He's guarded closely. Back to LeBron. 
block it is good LeBron James has got 22 and Matador defense that's one of the easiest shots he is ever going to see and this is what happens when you start to break your opponent's spirit the resistance is no longer there <laughs> Both teams racking up the points to start this game. And you wonder how long they can keep it going. At some point, you expect the defense will adjust. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for the Lakers. They kept going to him again and again. And he delivered with a monster quarter. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. And taking a look at the Lakers' performance here, what have they been doing or not doing in the game? Well, throughout the first quarter, they did a great job of just running the offense. Credit the game plan coming in. They've identified the right matchups, and the execution is there. So on the floor for the Lakers to start this second quarter. Up and forward, the star pairing of LeBron and Davis. Then it's Russell. Then there's Kobe. And it's Reeves in at the two guard. Right now, I'd send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Thanks very much, guys. Now, Kobe in their last game against the Grizzlies really contributed. He picked up 39 points, and that was just the start of it. He wound up with a triple-double in what was quite a display for him. He racked up big numbers in what was a really good performance. Can he carry it over tonight? We'll see, Kevin. Okay, David, thanks. It'll be interesting to see, Greg, how much of that performance carries over to tonight. And, Kevin, different scenarios call for different measures. I'm sure he'll just try to provide whatever they need for the win. Well, that's what it means to be unselfish, putting the team's interests first. As you say, he just wants to come away with the W. And different games different official. Something that might be called a foul in one game, Greg, may not be called in the next. As a player, how do you adjust to that? And it's a great question, and that's part of being a veteran. Uh, I learned early on, you actually two, scout three, officials three, the same way you scout the players. They have tendencies as well. Here's White. And again, it's Memphis with the three. They're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three-point range. LeBron passes to Kobe. Trying to get open is Davis. Good for the fifth time in five shots. He remains perfect. And of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is just smash mouth physical basketball, guys. Now here's Adams. And the Grizzlies tap in two more. Tough to miss that man. Desmond Bain read the defense perfectly. Russell dishes to Kobe. Second quarter of basketball, just over a minute and a half played so far. Reeves the pass to Kobe. And out of bounds is Memphis gains possession. <laughs> Adams has got the ball here for the Memphis Grizzlies. Nine-point game. Pass to Bain. Quarter number two. We're about two minutes in. It's blocked. And they recover it. And it's out of bounds. The Grizzlies able to retain possession here. Just five on the clock. Here's White. Yeah, just a solid job on the backboard. They are really controlling the inside. And Kobe throws it down. And he anticipated the play, and Kobe finished it on the other end. To the inside. And Adams with the slam. Up high and down hard with that one-hander. He got a little extra forceful. You're right with that one. Reeves the pass to Kobe. Trying to get open, it's Davis. And the basket by Kobe. Kobe's got 14. Such body control from Brian. Able to take some hits there on the way up. 
Right the pass to Adams. And Adams with the slam. That's the pass you want. Orchestrating the offense, creating for others. Lakers leading by nine. Pass to Reeves. Kicks it to Kobe. Feeds to LeBron. That's good. And it's LeBron Kobe with the assist. James has got 24 points. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. And there's the whistle, the illegal screen. Beyond the leaning, you can see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion around you. Annoying turnover. Now here's Kobe. He had a 39-point outing in their last game against Memphis. And his shot blocking almost single-handedly changed the game. No one wanted to put up a shot with him lurking. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Closing in on four minutes played here in the second quarter. James covering. From past the arc. Rebound the Lakers. Kobe's got his sixth rebound on the night. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the charts. Davis and finished off by Davis. The team relies on Davis for this. Keeping the play alive and finishing at the rim. There's the pass to Bing. on the trifecta. He's got five. This is the shot you want to get him. An open look from range. Allen for Anthony Davis, a big contributor to this team when healthy. Anthony Kevin A.D. does everything on the court that you ask of him. He can defend in space and guard just about anybody. Along with being a force on the offensive side, he's a terrific talent. Lakers leading by 15. And finished off by LeBron. LeBron. Though LeBron loves to keep his teammates involved, when he's feeling it, like tonight, he'll call his own number. Memphis has gone 2 or 3 when they've stepped beyond the arc in the second quarter. Outside, Bain. Passes it to Adams. Rejected by Kobe. And I think Kobe saw the shot coming a mile away. He instinctually gets there for the block. And the dunk by Kobe. Of the two offenses here tonight, you can tell theirs is just a bit more in sync. They've had better patience, better shot selection so far. But we still have a long way to go. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. Lakers passing it around. And another assist for him. That makes 15 assists. He's been one step ahead of the defense all game long. White finds Jackson. Back to White. He lobs it up. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley-oop. And it's the Lakers on the break. Kobe with the ball. They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points for the chance for another one at the strike. And the crisp passing has opened things up for them offensively. He made the only free throw attempt he had earlier in the game. And some changes here for the Grizzlies. Jamison's checked in, and it's Brandon Clark in for Jaron Jackson. Free throw good, Russell. No wasted trips at all. They're taking care of business at the line. To the paint. Rejected by Kobe. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the boards has been impressive. And the dunk by James. And what Kobe makes won. Kobe next level? The instinct for the game out. and ability to just see it before it happens. Timeout called the Grizzlies. And Coach can't like what he's seeing trying to get them refocused. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. 
Over to the wing. And stolen by LeBron. And here we go. Fast break. LeBron's got it. Again, Los Angeles. Strong work for him at the offensive end, helping them to maintain that lead. Jones against Russell to stop the run. Good on the bucket. Jones has got five. Oh, he had him spinning. He looks like he's dizzy after that crossover. And stolen by White. To the middle. Here's Jones. Right through the D for the layup. Jones has got his third basket of the night right there. Doesn't get exactly the screen he wants, but turns out he doesn't need it. MV finds Davis. Outside Russell. Now Kobe. Jamison covering. Here's Davis. Here's Kobe. And Kobe throws it down. And how fun is it watching Kobe take flight? His throwdowns are downright ridiculous. Shot from the top of the key, and the rejection by James. The feed to Kobe. Down low. That's good from Davis on the assist from Kobe. Davis has got 20. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. Back to Jones. Here's Jamison. The rebound by Kobe Bryant. Kobe's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Here's Davis, and he drops in the layup off the glass. 22 points for him. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. Jones against Russell. Addition out to Jamison. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. And his pure defensive effort changed that shot from an easy one to a tough one. And you know, technically, it's a high percentage look, but this is why we play the game. Outside, Jones. Jamison left side. And so the ball out of bounds. Davis touched it last. Gilman, he's checked in for Memphis. And the Lakers also making a switch. Schroeder's checked in. Jones, no one around him. Plenty of room to knock down the shot. And it's nine points for Tyus Jones. And so James will bring it up for Los Angeles. Last time they met was in Los Angeles. And it was pretty much a cakewalk for them the last time these two squared off and had a clear advantage on the backboard. They generated second chance opportunities on one end, preventing them on the other end. That was the story of the game. And another assist. And that's his 20th assist. Wow. Just doing a great job at orchestrating the offense. On our AT&T 5G Slam Cam, you just saw an explosive highlight. Let's a floater go, and Davis sends it back. Pass to Reeves for three. Here's LeBron. Second chance shot. He lays it in. James has got 32 points. Man, he has been locked in this quarter, shouldering the load at the offensive end. Schroeder finds James. Kobe with it. Jones covering. Here's Kobe. And the layup is good. Kobe's got 25 points in the game. They are just killing him on the interior. Outside, White. Back to Jones. Clark trying to get open. And that time, also a missed shot. I mean, all period, it's been a struggle for him scoring the ball. Kobe dishes to James. Back to Kobe. Good, and the Kobe assist goes to LeBron. Assisted by LeBron's LeBron got five James. assists in the game. Not a lot of resistance on the inside, and they're taking full advantage. 
and down it goes. It is Dunk through off a wonderful assist. There's a certain electricity to Schroeder's game, this time with the statement finish. Kobe, the pass to James. And he makes that one. LeBron James. LeBron's got 12 now in this quarter. Those defenders just look a little bit gassed. I mean, they're getting pushed around on that low block. Here's Clark. It's blocked. 32 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. Trying to go for an alley-oop, but excellent defense and anticipation there to stop it. Lobbed up there for Clark, and Memphis turns it over again. Unforced errors. These are the kinds of things that break momentum. And Memphis making a change here. Aldama's checked in. Schroeder kicks to Kobe. With one on the clock, and that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. 55, the Lakers, 97. Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. What can you say, LeBron James? What an impressive effort today. Man, he's been running wild on him through that first half. Absolute dynamite on offense. This is his challenge to continue to dominate, to help them try to close strong here in the second half. Adams is the pivot for him with Jackson Jr. at the four. Desmond Bain out there with Jones. And that's the group for Chandler Jenkins as we begin the second half. What a dangerous player to have in the backcourt. When Bain gets this hot, he will tear a defense apart. Here's Reeves after the made shot from Desmond Bain. Russell passes to Reeves. He dishes it to Kobe. Shot clock at five. Trying to get open is Davis. Kobe with the bucket. Kobe's got 29 in the game. One of the most dangerous scores in the game. Brian is taking no prisoners on the offensive end. That was a second look at our mobile one drive. Amazing control on display. And it's plays like that, Kevin, that show you why they are so far ahead. Didn't settle for anything outside and went right to the rim. Now here's Davis. Over Jackson. And Davis can't get it to go. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Bain, no good. And it's the Lakers' ball. During Desmond Bain's first season, Greg, he shot over 43% from three-point territory. And that was top 10 all time. And Bain's three-point numbers went up in his second season. From the start of his career, Desmond's been a premier shooter. Pass to Reeves. Lakers passing it around. Fires from 14. And that one's That's good by Davis. Davis. 24 points for him. Even when AD can't get inside, he's got options. He's got the touch from the mid-range. Right side, Russell. And again, another assist. The chemistry he has with his guys is impressive. Keeping his head on a swivel, actively seeking out his teammate. Payne finds Jones. Let's go. And that one goes long. You like that he's still attacking, but the results tonight just haven't been there. Covered by LeBron. A little over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of play. Here's Jones. That's good. And it's Jackson with the assist that time. Jackson's got three assists tonight. Here's Kobe. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. 
His the motor five. of Bryant never two. stops. Even inside where he goes Shooting right at the deep. And he's good on the second. And it's Jones with the ball for the Memphis Grizzlies. They've got the Timberwolves ahead of them next in Minneapolis. Sets in motion a four-game road trip for him. Here's Bain. It doesn't go for him. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Kobe with it. Now defended by Bain. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Grizzlies will take it. And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. And a block like that sends a message. One that says, we're not giving up this lead. Jones looking for an opening. It's stolen by Davis. Outside, Kobe. Buries it down low. Kobe's got five points now this quarter. Just crushing it here. 80% to start the half. Feeds to Adams. And Adams with the slam. A consistent hard worker. It's fun to see Steven Adams get his offensive game going. LeBron passes to Kobe. And the pass to Davis. Count it. Davis has got 26. I love that they're continuing to attack despite being up big. I'm impressed with their intensity tonight. They came in focused and they executed. Now here's Jones. 11 points in the game. Adams outside. He kicks to Jackson. And Davis sends it back. Adams shot is good. And you know, he's enjoyed the kind of day you expect in terms of shooting the basketball. He can bring them right back into this game. Here is Russell. Ten points for him. Floats it up for MP. Stolen by Jackson. Russell against Jones. Passes it to Jackson. There's the three. Sinks the three-pointer. Jackson's got nine points. This is a big part of Jackson's game. It isn't the best-looking shot, but it's deadly. Here's LeBron. Here's Kobe. And terrific work on the offensive glass when he picks up two. Kobe's got seven points here in this quarter. Memphis has gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Back to Jones. Pass to Adams. And Davis pulls it down. And the pressure he put on that shot forced the miscue. The rim protection at his finest. The result is the same whether you block the shot or simply change it. In case anyone was wondering, this is what it looks like when you're in the zone. He hasn't missed one all quarter. We know a lot of teams using former NBA officials now working as consultants to teach their players how the refs see the game. It's always looking for that edge. Yeah, Kevin, I think it's a great idea because philosophically sometimes as the rules evolve, players got to learn how to evolve with them. So not getting the calls you might expect, also how you communicate with officials. I think all of that stuff plays a big role in just furthering that dynamic between the officials and the players. So it's the Grizzlies now after the basket by Los Angeles. Jameson, and that comes off the assist by Jones. And just using the natural advantage he has, he can see over the top of the defense. And let's also add, he has touch from there. That's a solid shot for him. Here's James, lays it up off the glass. LeBron's got 36. Inside, James can really carve the defense apart. His strength makes him such a tough cover. Jones, the best to Jameson. Shoots from 14. That one drops for him. And they had assists now in their last three baskets. Outside, Kobe. To the paint, LeBron has doubled. Low block shot, and Kobe finishes inside. 
Kobe's got 40 points. Ooh, heat check after heat check. He rises to the occasion, trying to wheel his team to victory. Now, here's Bain. 14 points for him. Back to Jones. Shot clock at six. Pass to Jameson. And the whistle blows. Yeah, it's going to be on Jaron Jackson. Jackson Jr. That's his third his foul third of the game. Foul. Attacking the Second defense with the pass. Five. Don't need to be a hero. Tyler Clark has checked in for Jaron Jackson. Dennis Schroeder's checked in for Los Angeles. And it's Davis with the ball for Los Angeles. Russell with it. And it's Jamison picking him up. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. That's a tough ball. And the Grizzlies with possession here. Memphis has gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Outside, Jones. The nine-foot shot. And it's sent back by Kobe. And they get it back. Second chance effort. Jamison, no luck. And it's Russell in the corner. Here's Kobe. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle. So a chance at the line for one more. And now we'll get a perspective here on how the hustle game has been going for the Lakers. Shooting it's easy for me. Look at their defensive effort all game. The block total shows their commitment to contesting shots. And they've also forced a lot of turnovers, capitalizing and turning those turnovers into points. Way to get after it. And looks like the illegal pick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. And not the most accurate call you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue that pick wasn't illegal. It's often a tough call that can go either way, but I agree with you on that one. Tillman, he's checked in for the Grizzlies. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by James. This is what we talk about, valuing each possession, avoiding those kinds of mistakes. Here's Jones, 11 points in the game. Outside, Bain. Looking for Clark, and he gets it there. An emphatic LU champ. Unselfish score. If his shot isn't there, Bain will move the ball. James dishes to Kobe. Tries again. And that one is good with the extra effort on the glass. Kobe's got 44. The Grizzlies shooting it up around 51%. They're getting good looks. Jones kicks to White. The pass to Bain. Takes the three. And again, it's Memphis with the three. You know he's pulling his weight, but they still find themselves behind. Schroeder passes to LeBron. Back to Schroeder. On the wing, Kobe. And he uses the glass Kobe on the lane. Won. Kobe's got 46 points. Again and again, they're dissecting the defense and creating those high percentage looks from inside. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two on baseline, J. And it's sent back by Russell. He blocks it again. Uh, a defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Greg protecting the rim. Love the hustle. Right side, Kobe. Another possession. Another assist. 25 assists. What an unselfish performance. He has been a sensational playmaker. Outside, White. Clark kicks to Bain. Over LeBron. And they get it back. Five to shoot. White. They've given up a lot of three-pointers here today. The Lakers controlling the game. Schroeder outside. Now here's Kobe. He's covered closely. Hangs in midair and converts on the double clutch layup. 
inside the paint, Bryant is just as much trouble. He's practically a sure thing from in close. Here's Bain. The shot misses. Good D by James. Here's Russell. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. So far. And having added strength to his wiry frame, Russell able to convert through contact there at the line for draw the foul. He's gone two for two at the line so far. 84%. That, that's what he was able to convert on a season ago from the line. The Grizzlies making a switch here. Aldama's checked in. There's 42 seconds left in the third quarter. And White kicks to Bain. Passes to Eldama. Back to Bain. Over Russell. Bain, no good. And so, MV will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. And yep, another basket. My goodness. 50 for the game. Yep, he is putting on a show. Bain looking around. Over Russell. Gets it to fall. The bucket from Bain. Bain's got seven points here in this quarter. Desmond Bain showing off his strength. That's a tough shot inside. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers with a huge lead at the break. Safe to say there's no catching them today. This has been a one-sided matchup, and I don't see any signs of it lessening. We'll return shortly. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? Uh, just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? Execution. This is what you practice every day. These guys are professionals. Beautiful play. And one quarter to go in a game that to this point has not been an evenly fought contest. So the Lakers five right now. Up and forward, the star pairing of LeBron and Davis. Then there's Kobe. Then there's Dennis Schroeder. And it's Reeves in at the shooting guard position. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. With this diverse skill set and size, Davis is a matchup nightmare for anyone in the league. At the line for two. He misses the free throw. And the average age of NBA players is getting younger and younger and now about a year younger than they were a decade ago, Steve. Kevin, I'm sure you're correct. But for me, I'm also seeing guys play longer and longer and longer. The old guys are sticking around. Williams up on top. Pass to Jamison. Tipped away. And it's sent back by Kobe. And out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession. Here's James. Loads it up for Davis. Lays it in off the pretty alley-oop. The passing of LeBron is so special. So talented at finding his wide-open teammates. Grizzly shooting 49% on the game. They'll take that. He's guarded by Schroeder. Battles through traffic and lays it in. And the Lakers with possession here. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. LeBron can't get it to go. And so it's Memphis with it. LeBron with the block. Now Kobe. 
second shot opportunity. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming out. Second you know, it's so ball. many things AD second can do on the floor ball. to help your team win. At the line for the Lakers, Anthony Davis taking two shots. And that one misses. The leadership of the NBA Players Association, Greg, has said they support expansion. And two cities, which seem to be the leading candidates, Seattle and Las Vegas. What do you think? Yeah, well, I love both. Had the good fortune of playing in both cities. And I'd love to see a team in my hometown. But bottom line, more teams means more jobs. And that's a sentiment I think most can get behind. Here's James after Memphis gets the three. Kobe with it. Williams picks him up. Here's Kobe. And got it! Another basket. And he's up to 52 points. Yeah, making a GA look all too easy right now. For the Lakers, Kobe Bryant shooting one. Grizzlies have gone two of four from the field since we started the final quarter of play. Covered by LeBron. The eight footer and good at that time. Given the size disadvantage, you have to have a lot of confidence to take that shot. And also a lot of skill. This is exactly the type of thing you practice for over and over again. Here's Reeves following the score by Memphis. Six to shoot. Pass to Kobe. And the dunk by Kobe. More of a score first point guard with Schroeder doing a good job of finding the open band. Grizzlies have gone three of five here in the fourth quarter. Pretty good numbers coming out of the break. And every year, it seems like outcomes in the playoffs can hinge on health. Steve, it's part of the game, as you well know. It is, Kevin, and we hate it because obviously health can change the direction Austin of a series Reed. or a team. But the one thing teams are doing a better job is they are lengthening and going deeper into their bench. And so here's Memphis after the basket by Los Angeles. Outside Williams. Plenty of space. Rebound the Lakers. Kobe's... And listen, sometimes even the best of us are going to miss the easiest of opportunities. And that will be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Smitty, after going undrafted, Austin Reeves was given a much larger role than anticipated in his rookie year. Kevin, he held his own. Coming through in some clutch moments and bringing intensity and effort on a nightly basis. First free throw is good. Off on that one, so he goes one for two at the line. Grizzly shooting 49% on the game. They'll take that. And another miss by Memphis. And so it's Davis. He'll bring the ball up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Loads it up for Davis. And Kobe throws it down. And they're getting points. They're getting stops. And this is how they'd like to play all the time. Yes. When it's going good, it feels easy. These are the nights you relish, but they're tough to replicate. Here's Williams following the bucket by the Lakers. Outside for Jamison to end the run. Jamison with the basket on the assist by Williams. Jamison's got six here in this quarter. And they have been relentless from deep. And you see the defense trying to react. 
but to no avail. You know what? They talked about this at halftime, and they're doing a better job of creating space. Hey, hey, right here. LeBron outside. He feeds it to Kobe. Hits it again. Wow. And this game has his name written all over it. Greg, he's been phenomenal in offensive onslaught. Some things change here in the league, but a little trash talk still seems, Steve, like a key component to the game. Uh, I'm having a hard time remembering. Did you partake in that? I, I did, Kevin, but I didn't call it trash talk. We just talked, and you tried to get into your opponent's head. And also, for me, I played better when I was talking. Kicks it to Jamison. Good on the baseline, Jay. A tail of two halves. He's really turned it around here, scoring the ball. Schroeder outside. And again, that's 62 points. 62. Amazing. A, a remarkable performance from him so far. Now the pass to Williams. Goes up at the stripe, and the Grizzlies tap down two more. This is what you do when your opponents try to take away the three and the painted area. Here's Schroeder, and that one drops for him. We talk about Schroeder's toughness. Just shrugs off the hit and keeps on going. Passes it to Eldama. And a miss there on the triple. For Los Angeles, they've gone 8 of 11 from the field in the final period. Great shooting down the stretch. I mean, you know what? Very close to a three-point play His right there. personal foul. Team is in the penalty. At the line for the Lakers, LeBron James. Two shots. That free throw missing. We talk about players. Steve, we talk about coaches and GMs, but not too much about owners and their effect on the game and the organization. Kevin, the owners for me are A1. It starts from the top. They're the ones who hire the team president, GMs, and coaches. And certainly, there are some teams who have some great owners. Open jump shot off the mark. The Lakers on offense. Dishes to Kobe. And another one falls. And he's been dominant here thus far. Shouldering the offense, GA really taking it to the opposition. Here's Eldama. Covered by LeBron. Ball's not loose. And stolen by James. Pass to Kobe. Outside for Davis. Back to Kobe. Connects again. And he's been dominant here thus far. Shouldering the offense, GA really taking it to the opposition. They need this. No good on the shot, a bit long that time. Great focus on the defensive end there to contest that shot. And this is where you would prefer to work the ball to someone else for just a better look. Uh, I'll tell you, it's one thing to do this at home, another to do it in a hostile environment. They built up this huge league with great play at both ends. They're going to love watching film tomorrow. He takes advantage of them in every way possible. And Greg, he lures them into a trap on the steal, and then bang, straight to the bucket. Great activity at both ends. Great teamwork as well. Takes it from 10. Doesn't go for him. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. And for his offense, this has just been a brutal period. And again, and another assist. Another possession, another assist. You know, Greg, he's sharing the ball well, hitting his guys in their spots. Pass to Eldama. Now here's Williams. 
off target with the close range fadeaway. All the energy is on the other side right now, and every miss just makes it worse. You know what? This has always been a debate. Do you take the time out, or do you let your guys try to fight through it? Outside, Williams. Some nice passing there by Memphis. To end the drought. And it hung on the rim, but wouldn't fall for him. And so, MP will bring it up for Los Angeles. The feed to Davis. And another assist. Well, he's now tied for third all-time in the record books for most assists in a game. G.A., he's been playing all game long like he knows exactly when and where to pass the ball. It's incredible. And so much great talent coming into the league, Greg, every year. That 2021 draft class, in particular, looks very strong. Absolutely. Anytime you got just a couple potential stars. But from the and another assist for him. I am just speechless here. He has now tied the record for most assists in a game. Easily a transcendent game for him and his team. G8, he keeps setting up his teammates, and they keep knocking him down. Well, you look at the 30 assists for him. He, he's matched Skiles' mark from 1990, and it's, it's been a true team effort as he can't do it without his teammates knocking down shots. And yes, it's good. Here's Schroeder. Outside, Kobe. Now the dish to Davis. Two minutes. The jump hook. It's rebounded by Memphis. Deflects the pass. Kobe with the steal. Another possession. Another assist. And the record is his alone. A game. Truly a game for the ages. How lucky are we to have seen it? This guy has been terrific passing his oh, way into history before our very eyes. For so long, Scott Skowser's mark of 30 assists is the top of the history books. Still in shock it was toppled here tonight. And now we present our New Balance player of the game, LeBron James. And Kevin, it's a no-brainer. He's controlled every aspect of this game and it's just so fun to see a player perform at a level that's just higher than anyone else out on the floor well to come in here facing a hostile crowd and have a game like he's had that's what separates the good players from the great players hey guys he's not an easy man to stop when he's got the rim in his sights never has been never will be he is a determined finisher and a chance to just stare at the statue. The assist numbers he's amassed tonight. Hard to believe. And GA playing on the road, but he's won over some fans with the show he's putting on here. We're witnessing something special here. His ability to read the defense and deliver pinpoint passes is off the charts. There's the steal. And as we head to the final buzzer here, a crushing blowout. Big time dominance, and, and this will go in the record books as a gouty win for the Lakers. This was a team performing to its uh, fullest capability. Uh, a, a hugely satisfying win. A, a, a game that not many will soon forget, and on the other side, one that I think most will try to forget. And with this effort tonight, grabbing their eighth win of the year. And continued dominance against this team, winning both of their matchups this season. And we watched one guy all night long, guys. And look at the stats, just confirms what a dominant game he had. What a night tonight it was for Kobe Bryant. An all-around dominant performance. Only certain guys can do this. Complete control, three phases of the game. Congrats, a triple-double. Now here's Schroeder. He's tightly guarded. Inspired tonight. They fought hard and at crucial points just made the plays. Especially during this last run, which ultimately put the game away. And on the AT&T 5G Slam Cam, you can see how impressive that move was. The pass to Bain. To the inside. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. 
and giving up some inches inside, but makes up for it with an aggressive style. And that takes skill and the ability to make adjustments as you're going up. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Here's Reeves. And the Lakers get it back. Wow, another opportunity. Just everything going their way. Pretty much the story of this game. Here's James. He sinks the 11-footer. James. James has got 41. They just blocked out the noise, kept on grinding, and this is their reward. And guess what? It's going to be a fun flight home. Total team effort. That Big win on the game. road. And so it's the Lakers taking care of business here. To come into an opponent's building and dominate the way they did tonight says, I think, Greg, an awful lot about this team. I guess they don't need home cooking to feel at home. I mean, Kevin, just a masterful performance all the way around. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge. This